Um, just for those that aren't familiar with the PA program at Mac, mm -hmm. uh, what is clerkship? Right, clerkship, so all the schools use their own funny words, but essentially clerkship is your year of rotations where you do core placements in things like family medicine, emergency medicine, surgery. They're generally four to six weeks, um, and then there's also two electives. Where are generally the locations for rotations with the McMaster PA program? A lot of them are in the Hamilton and the Hamilton greater area. So uh, Stony Creek, St. Catharines, Burlington, Oakville, uh, those sort of areas, but they have some pretty far reach. I mean, some of my classmates are in Delhi and Kitchener and Guelph, those areas. Um, and then some are in Toronto, lesser in Toronto, but you know, if you want to set up an elective or there's some core emergency medicine rotations in Toronto, um, the big teaching hospitals. And is there the option to do rural, out of province, or international electives? Absolutely. Uh, you have to sign up through ROM. Um, so the school will help you do that. It's uh, to do rural placements. There is uh, definitely incentives and benefits to doing a rural placement. I have some interest in it. What are you looking forward to in second year? Ooh, doing all the procedures. But I think I really, really, really want to intubate a patient. I've heard so much about it from my mom. I've talked shop with her for 15 years and now having practiced it on our clerkship transition day on some of the um, the mannequins, like it's just been something that I'm so excited about doing. So anything sort of procedural, doing um, a physical exams with the patients, you know, I'm, I'm a little bit more comfortable with the IVs, the phlebotomy, you know, drawing blood, giving intramuscular injections, performing ECGs, ultrasounds. Um, I did carotid ultrasounds as well for my other job. So I feel like those sort of things I'm going to be a little bit less excited to do because it'll be um, not as much of a novelty, but something that's newer that I haven't done before, probably even just putting oxygen on a patient will get me excited initially. I just wanted to thank you, Anne, for having me um, on your series here. It's been a privilege and an honor, and I appreciate everything that you do for our community and everything that you've done for me, even in my first year so far. Awesome. Thank you. Thank I really you. appreciate that.